Еще остановка. Улица Хакурата. Са. Вырайга. Трамбей. Трамбай. 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 It's more than the day outside. It's a January 13th. In Russia, it's a new old new year. I talked about that in my previous video. But um, it's nice and here and so out of the chair. Better people using it. The lines are very convenient. You can get anywhere within the city just in a train. The ticket is in the show now. I got one. No. So the ticket is... Woody Rubbles. Which is... Literally... Around 50 cents. Just the price. Woody Rubbles. So for 50 cents... This way. Ride the tram from anywhere you want. Basically, uh, the, the tram system is very, very convenient. This is the old town. Some of these uh, buildings you see, they are more than 150 years. Some are over 100 years, but way before um, the Great Revolution in 1917. Some of these buildings you can see, they all buildings. Those are from communism time during the Nikita show. So I would say uh, 1950, 1957. But uh, they located in the area. Almost in downtown of the city, which is like very, very old. The town, it's a city itself, is over 250 years old. <clears throat> so we ride, we ride in, in a very old tram system um, ways. So all the buildings around us, they are pretty much old. So don't get scared that um, we can see older buildings all over the gates. This is the class. This is just the old part of the of the city. When this is easy that if you see the some new areas where the new houses been built, it's a completely different story. There's modern, very beautiful buildings, condas mostly. People own the uh, condominiums over there. Some for sale. Prices in this house are one bedroom, one bedroom condominium around um, 120, 150 thousand dollars. It's just a small one bedroom. The biggest, bigger one, this balcony is like that. This will be probably two bedroom and they will be more expensive. Uh, this whole building has on the first floor a lot of commercial um, businesses. You can get uh, manicure, pedicure, massage, there's pharmacy, flowers, um, even uh, Russian McDonald's, which is um, Yummy period, <laughs> but <clears throat> yes, unfortunately, all this very old areas it's difficult to just rebuild it because people live in fear and infrastructure will not support new constructions. But everything outside of the old, um infrastructure uh, systems people are building quite crazy i will show you some videos on the outskirts of krasnodar there is like uh, great new subdivisions growing like mushrooms <clears throat> so many new buildings so many new private homes it's a huge cottage villages all over the uh, place and suburbs
In the game right now, oh, it's a winter time. So this is all construction. You see the fence? This is a new area already ready for constructions. They're so gonna demolish this old buildings right here and uh, rebuild here. Most people, uh, I would say average salary level, income level and up, they are driving cars. All the families have two and more cars. And of course, Russia is very much um, Christian Orthodox religion country, so plenty of um, all kind of churches, cathedrals all over the place. Some of those are really old, over 150 years old. When the city was established, they were built. Uh, so this, those buildings, they were used to, they built um, back in 1950s to in Nikita Khrushchev, and they call Khrushchevki. Unfortunately, city, uh, fortunately, city grew so much since then. So, uh, you know, the suburbs are more developed than new, and this old downtown area still has this old buildings from 1950s but um, in any case the uh, people try to keep them romantic content constantly repaying them taking care of the utilities so people have central gas heat water, sewage, and I guess what, your utility bills a month uh, for one bedroom apartment will be between $20 to $40 per month, depends on the season. Um, during the winter time you will pay a little bit more because you use a lot of heater, heating. So I'm showing you, like I said, old buildings along the tramway. If you go into center of the city, you will see all the new, beautiful, modern, high-class buildings. Some trains are old, uh, since 1990s, when I used to live in this city, and I used to be a student at university. And uh, some trains, uh, trains and uh, carriages, uh, they are brand new, and you can see the difference very quickly, which are new, which are old. You see, there are some of those uh, condominium has been built not so long time ago, so they're beautiful. This is um, the palace of marriages, so marriage registrations are here. Uh, very often you can see a lot of weddings. So this is one of the new carriages you can see in the trampoline. And <clears throat> this one is uh, like a city park called Chestikovska Russia used to be the uh, Russia of uh, May 1st and you can see a lot of new buses as well some buses are electric buses you cannot believe how snow in the day so this is a city park and this city park is really really old one of the oldest one in the city and I would say it's probably close to 200 years, maybe even older, but it's a fun area here. A lot of kids uh, come in here with parents, there's a lot of attractions. And this is the main entrance and on this arch, you see. My daughter was little, we used to come here, it was a lot of fun.
with your friends especially during the uh, spring season it's really shady here I think that I feel the flow is cool and where are we going guys? I'm going to my chiropractor. So chiropractor here in Russia, about one hour. One hour will be around 13 dollars. Believe it or not, and the chiropractors here are just uh, stellar. They're absolutely amazing. They're very knowledgeable. A lot of them know um, have med medical degrees, and they know what to do. So, get that. Now we need to find my place. Where are we going? So you see the stream? Oh, it's moving so nice. Beautiful. Love it. So anyway, guys, almost done. I got to the place where I need to be. And I hope you enjoy this whole painting. It is me on a way. And like I said, I did not show you the downtown with all the pretty expensive places i'm sure they know this the simple life of russian people they're using tram system because it's so easy to get from a point a to point b and i'm sure they knew this beautiful winter snow day but by now see you later